हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम सरोज विश्वास गोल्ड मेडलिस्ट फर्स्ट रैंक होल्डर ऑफ 1994 बैच इन इंजीनियरिंग स्ट्रीम ऑफ ऑल द कॉलेजेस एफिलिएटेड टू यूनिवर्सिटी ऑफ मैसूर ड्यूरिंग दैट पीरियड ए बी इन सिविल इंजीनियरिंग फ्रॉम नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग मैसूर ए एम टेक इन स्ट्रक्चरल इंजीनियरिंग फ्रॉम इंडियन इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी दिल्ली दैट इज आई आई टी ए सन सर्टिफाइड जाबा प्रोग्रामर सन माइक्रो सिस्टम यूएसए I have more than 25 years of professional experience in designing building structures and allied subsidiaries. I invite you all to learn with me how to design building structures using commercially available structural softwares with the help of some manual computation as and when needed. In this tutorial we shall try to learn design of steel structure for build for this purpose a hypothetical building has for office uses objective of this tutorial is to help budding structural engineer to learn design let us now discuss what is being received by an structural engineer before he proceeds for design this will be a document containing the architectural scheme it shall contain the plan elevation sections elevation etc for the proposed building for this hypothetical building we see in the architectural document mezzanine floor plan and the ground floor plan has been provided the building dimensions and other things have been provided the office area shall have light lightweight partition which has to be planned later the office area shall be the, the air condition space now the customer require require dry wall around this office area this is the dry wall so this has been asked by the customer obviously this is since this is the air condition space the entire building will be enveloped by metal cladding that is eve industry the mezzanine floor consists of two bays the area between grid c and d is double height area this is the area which is double height in the architectural section the floor to floor height has been provided by the architect 25 meter there is a clear height requirement that has been also specified by the customer or the architect 6.5 meter is the clear height that is bottom of the top structural member shall, shall be 6.5 meter above the finished floor level at ground level this is the finished floor level the finish specified the architect is 50 mm so the depth of the metal deck slab has been left to the decision of the structural engineer the metal deck slab is nothing but a corrugated metal sheet which is poured with concrete with nominal reinforcement say around 8 mm bar 200 center to center it depends on the load the metal deck slab is supported on joist joist are nothing but simply supported beams uh, closely spaced the spacing of this beams or joist depends on what is the capacity of the metal deck to carry the weight of weight concrete this joist are in turn supported by main beam or secondary beam in pv industry these are also called as main girder or secondary girder for the architect is delhi ncr region and also they have mentioned that the basic unit speed for the project is to be taken as per is 75 part 3 and not as per nbc so as per nbc in delhi ncr region 50 meter per second is specified but in is 75 part 3 it is 47 This ends the brief discussion about the architectural requirement or the requirement provided with the customers.